Hi, welcome to the world of natural wigs. This is one of our shorter wigs. It's actually called an Amy. It's a beautiful, beautiful wig. But sometimes we have with any of the wigs, it doesn't happen very often, that because of the way it's folded in the shipping and it comes, it does come from China, um, and sometimes it'll sit in the box for a while, even in our place, you could have that the hair will be folded in a way that it's going to jump up. And I just wanted to show you, it's not that the wig is damaged. It really just needs a little bit of TLC. What we do is we section the hair, we dampen a towel, and again, we do really well with water, the natural line. So don't be afraid of heat and water. Because it's heat resistant, it takes it very well. And what I'll do is I'll sort of tell the handmade sewn pieces which direction I want them to go. So I want that to go that way and that to go that way. And it listens. No blow dryer, nothing. Just a little bit of water and a very wet towel. Okay, so now like this, some people actually opt for this because they like the fullness to start up there. I, I like it to look like a haircut and that one section should blend into the other. So if this was the wig that I was doing, I would brush it down, comb it down like that with the water. You have to realize these are hand knotted pieces. So the minute you go change the direction of the knotting, it will last even through the next washings and stuff. You don't have to worry about that. So again, my, my towel is very, very wet. I squeezed it out. It doesn't matter if it's cold or warm. It doesn't matter. The iron is probably on a medium setting. And you're going to see as you do this, it's going to almost smell like you're ironing a piece of uh, something of clothing. It's really quite kind of cool. When you smell it, you realize that it really is made out of a polymer fiber and not a conecolon. It's really our proof when you smell how an iron smells against the hair. You know, of course, if I would have taken a towel that's half the size, probably would have worked a little bit better. You'd be able to see better. I apologize about that. Okay, now at this point, I'm just going to let it air dry. Now, the question is how much I want to do that, because at the top, I kind of like that it's got that oomph. So I would really stop here. But you'll even look, sometimes it happens on the sides. This would not, but if it did, I would do the same thing. I would spray it with water, and I would iron it down like that. And don't be afraid. I actually learned this from one of the European hair makers, that let's say you have a client who really does not like, I think it's gorgeous, but does not like this fullness up there. You could do the same thing. You could just take a wet towel and place it on there and iron it down. I don't want to do it because I really love this wig just the way it looks, but you really have that option as well. Thank you very much.